Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and for today's video I'm going to be doing an unboxing video from all the stuff that I got from Tokyo, Japan. Yes, I am back and I'm going to be doing it in sort of two parts because this is going to be everything I got from Tokyo and Disneyland and all that sort of stuff and then a separate video for everything from the Pokemon Center. So just to reiterate, this is not going to be anything from the Pokemon Center. There will be a full separate video for all of that but everything else that I got I'm going to start unboxing and I'm just excited to show you what I got oh my god so first obviously I got this t-shirt which is a Mickey Mouse rainbow pride Disneyland t-shirt which I love sticking with clothes the next thing I got from Disney was this really cute sort of hoodie like rainbow vibe oh my god I actually I tried it on when I was there I think it's a medium because I was a bit like oh I don't know if I'm gonna get a small or a medium because you just never know so I definitely got a medium and yeah, I think it's dead cute. It's like, oh, it fits great and it'll be great for like the winter as well. Like, oh, I'm going to be all rainbowed up and everything. Yeah, so, oh, it's so cute. And the final piece of clothing I got was this Tokyo Japan t-shirt, which I got at Shibuya Crossing. There was like a little shop there and it had like loads of sort of cute merchandise and like touristy stuff. So, I haven't actually opened this or tried it on yet, but I'm going to open it. Oh my god, it's so cute. And I got it in a small because like mostly like this t-shirt's a small as well. And I figured it would be just fine. And yeah, it seems fine. Oh my god, it's so cute. I love how it's got Japan and like the red, obviously from the flag. It's like red, white and black, which are like my favourite colours. So yeah, oh my god, I'm loving that. So I can't wait to wear that. Sticking with Disney, I also got some Minnie Mouse and also Mickey Mouse ears with the little hat. So I wore this when I was at Disney and I'll show you some pictures from like my general sort of time in Tokyo and this one I haven't took the little tag off but yeah they're so cute oh my god seriously so it's like so this is them as a close-up oh my god they're so cute obviously the mini ears and the Mickey ears and they go together as a set oh, and loads of people were wearing them as well so usually like as they were wandering around the park that kind of thing so they are so cute the next thing I got from Disney was this really cute Winnie the Pooh key ring oh my god with this little honey pot I remember my mum had one from like years ago I don't know if we got it from Disneyland Florida but I really wanted one so I was like oh my god honey here we go and the last thing I got from Disney in the spirit of Halloween is this Monsters Inc lantern oh my god it's so cute it's got like a cute little handle and it lights up and on the bottom oh my god look so so cool seriously so it lights up and it's got the light and then you can actually like put the light on the wall and it does that oh my god it's so cool though i just thought oh my god it's like halloween and they were also into halloween over there so i thought it's a perfect time to get this cute little lantern <laughs> So sticking with Disney, this is the actual ticket for the park and it's super cute. Obviously it's in Japanese and I got a Minnie Mouse one. So I was like, oh my God, how cute. And this is the receipt. I just thought I'd show you because it's like, it's so cool how it's literally like in yen and like, oh my God, it's so cool. And on my last day, I went to the Tokyo Tower. So I got a couple of cute little things from there. And so I got this sort of Hello Kitty shot glass with the Tokyo Tower on it. And I'm actually, I'm not like, that big on like shots and stuff but I'm excited to open this I need to have a look inside ah oh, it's so cute it's Ooh, ASMR ASMR that's cute, so that's just something that I'll have as like a sort of momentous thing, like you know how people collect shot glasses, but I don't know, I just sort of, I thought it was cute, it has all the different sort of patterns and like the, the tower on and everything, so I really like that. I also got myself a fan because I love and live for fans, so I'm excited to have a look at this one because it's black and red and it's got the Tokyo Tower on it. I love these small fans like obviously I got one from the Pokemon Center which I used for a drag race video but oh wow it's so cool so it's obviously got like different patterns and it's got the tower over the side there it's so cute there's like just a little fan And speaking of fans, I actually got a second one from a different shop, which was in Shibuya Crossing. So I thought, oh, I just really wanted some fans. So I was like, you know what? May as well get another one. Oh, this one's like cute and pink. I think it's like floral. I can't really remember to be fair. Ooh. 
I like that. I like how it's like pink and glittery and it's got like the brown sort of wooden handle. It's very cute. I like that. Yeah. It's just stuff like this which is so cool. Like I'm so glad I got because it just sort of has sort of memories of the place. It's all like so Japanese. Like these fans are like so like these are from Japan. Not just like ordered online or anything. I can't believe like oh, it's so cool. So when I was up the Tokyo Tower, you get to do like a photo shoot and there was a one halfway up, but if you paid for the top flight, you get a different one. So I did both, but I got this one, which is the halfway up. It's like a green screen photograph here, and then you can pay for the actual one here. So obviously you're not up the tower on this one. It's just a green screen, but it's so cute. And I'll like, I'll scan it in and show you the picture on the video. And then the second one was the actual one from the top, which is so nice. It comes in this really nice packaging. Wow, and inside is obviously the photograph, so there's the free picture which is in black and white or you can pay and get the actual photo from up top and oh, it's so nice and like I say I'll scan that in to show you but it's so nice that it just comes in this whole like packaging thing and everything so it's nice to keep as like a momentous thing. It says, here at the top deck you can enjoy a VIP experience. Do you know what VIP stands for? Very important person. No, no, no. Here in Tokyo tower vip stands for very impressive panoramas and that is true oh my god i got some great pictures and videos which will be in the vlog and some great views like seriously the city like is so widespread and big i just oh my god it was incredible and this is the ticket for the top deck tour of the tokyo tower so it's dead cute so my sort of tour was four o'clock which was great because it was like daytime and then it went into sunset then nine times so I got to experience like all three while up there to get like good views and pictures and everything so that was incredible. Just to show you as well this was the ticket for the robot restaurant for the Halloween thing which was really cute and just totally crazy and it's in the vlog so if you go check that out seriously. And I used the sort of tube underground system obviously I didn't really use this map because it's all in Japanese but it's so cool just to see the sort of central bits of where we were and everything, I think. Is that the right way? Ah, I think it's this way. <laughs> but yeah, seriously, so like the Tokyo Tower was sort of around here, I think. And we were staying up here and Shibuya Crossing's over here. So uh, it's so cool just to look back and think we literally went all these places. And the final thing I want to show you is this cute little photo booth thing. Me and Leon did like this photo booth in like this arcade place and it turned you into like cutesy like eyes and stuff and we didn't actually get to keep the photos as like jpegs because they sent us an email but we didn't really understand what to do but we'd already paid for like the slips so he got the other half and then I got this half and the final thing that I want to show you is this suitcase which obviously wouldn't fit on the other screen but I needed to get another case because I bought so many things from the Pokemon Center that I wasn't going to get them back in my case and it just happened to be like this cute Pikachu one it's not from the Pokemon Center I just sort of found it at the train station and it's just so perfect because it's yellow and it's got the cute little Pikachu on and it's got Pikachu on the back look how cute is that and seriously it was a lifesaver because I really needed to get another case and I've got that forever now so I'm just so glad that I got that it's super cute so that's pretty much it for this video. Hope you guys all enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. I'm so so like excited just everything that I got seriously is so so cool and I just the memories from like being in Japan and everything and I'll show you some pictures but obviously go check out the vlogs and the pictures will be on my Instagram as well and stay tuned because I will be doing a Pokemon Center unboxing video of everything I got including Pokemon cards so that's gonna be crazy but yeah that's all for this video so thank you for watching I will see you very soon bye guys